So today, day 79, it was a little bit wet and dreary out there. Um, uh, but got in the kilometers and uh, uh, happy to be inside. Thanks, buddy. Uh, today I just wanted to talk about this little girl. She's one of my best friends, this Kuna. And um, I got her about six or seven years ago from uh, the Peterborough SPCA or the he Peterborough Humane Society, rather. She's liking the salt on my neck. That's, uh, that's lovely. Um, and uh, where I lived in Halberton, we had, um, where I lived and worked, there, there were about 900 acres of forest, so I could let her off the leash uh, quite a bit. And uh, within the first month of having her, she, uh, she came back with um, porcupine quills in her mouth one day. Uh, she'd had a little encounter. And then um, one time we had a bear encounter and she stood between me and the bear as if she was trying to protect me. And then not too long ago, about a, a year ago, she had a, a moose encounter. Uh, chased a moose for a while and then uh, the moose had had enough, knew that Kuna wasn't gonna do anything to it and so um, it took about four hours to get Kuna away from uh, away from the moose. Hello! <laughs> so um, anyways there's no doubt when we go into schools we uh, we talk to the students uh, and sometimes they say their answer as to what they like doing outside is is walking their dog and um, and so it's uh, it's been great having having this dog and uh, I think for anyone you know having a dog gets them outside a little bit more but I guess the question today was uh, human or non-human who's uh, who's your best friend and, and you get to spend some time with them outside so just thankful for this best friend and uh, the time we get to spend outside